Well, hello, kitten. You're just in time for a Valentine's story book. Today's author isn't by any measure a good author. Let us begin our journey into I'll Take You. Arrgh! Sorry, I don't know what came up for me. Once upon a time, there lived two Twitter painted owls in a hickory tree hutch, and they loved each other very much. Tomorrow was Valentine's Day, and their excitement was hard to delay. Now owls are known for their wisdom, and are readily sought out for their thoughtful solutions to difficult issues. But where do owls go when they have conundrums of their own? You see, neither owl remembered Valentine's Day was tomorrow until just now. Why the deep fried pickle on the moon, of course, up where stars shine bright above you, and night breezes seem to whisper, I love you. Sitting steadily on opposite sides of the timber tree, the owls wondered, where could they find the one gift that says it all, the night before Valentine's Day? Well, unknown to the Twitterpated two, when the deep fried pickle spoke, he was speaking to them both. Donde esta Zapateria que es en el mendicolo? No sé. <laughs> Amor. Which means, the gift you seek is not somewhere outside the tree hutch, but in the moments where you have loved each other very, very much. And in that moment, with those words, they saw each other, who they loved very much, through the hole in the hickory tree hutch. Now this moment's very important, because this is the moment where time will slow to the pace between a sight creep of a lightning bug's light beep, and memories of loving times throughout the year blossom in their minds and hearts. The lovers played on a swing before they came across a wild beast pig thing. Oh, Mr. Owl bravely distracted the beast with cries while Mrs. Owl nearly slipped by. You can see the, the little crumbles there on the side of the hill. Oh, not now, Cooper! Stars. All right. Now, where were we? Ah, uh, yes. Bike rides and I love yous made their way around the city, especially in yellow rock chalk, which Mr. Owl found on the bike ride. They all pair love no matter where. They found it in the sea, they found it in the land, and in the air. At night, the two cuddled with a bowl of homemade popcorn which Mrs. Owl made, and they watched Dr. Katz and his son crack jokes until they softly fell asleep. It was in this moment that the two realized that they didn't need a special day to prove the words I love you to one another. You see, they prove it every day in the little things they do for each other, celebrated in their laughter, treasured in moments that a Valentine's Day gift could never fully represent. And with that, the Twitter painted too loved a little more. Happy Valentine's Day, Jody. <laughs>